Hey, what's up, YouTube? Say Fall Man here, Emory. I figured I'd bring another vlog video. Kind of tell you guys what I've been up to. I ain't been up to too much. Uh, I've been building those Minecraft sets and reviewing them. And I gotta thank you guys for putting up with me for uh, those reviews because I don't know nothing about Minecraft. But I'm just kind of giving my thoughts on those sets. Uh, they're pretty cool sets. I don't know. You guys let me know. You guys, I mean, I guess Minecraft's everywhere. Everybody's playing it. I don't know if you guys are playing it or not. Well, let me just show you kind of what I've been doing out here. As you guys know, I tore up the chicken restaurant. Kind of staged that for a picture on Instagram. I think that looks pretty cool. But I'm waiting on some pieces to come in from Happy Blue's place. And then I'm going to get that all put together. And like I said, that's going to probably be two stories. And then I also ordered a whole bunch more bricks for SIG Towers. I think I want to take that at least another three stories. Otherwise, it's really not a tower. It's just kind of a building. So that's kind of what I got going on. And I just picked up some of these. What is this? Set number 70800, the uh, Lego movie. I got eight of those from Walmart for like 10 bucks. I'm going to part them out, put them in my store, see if anybody buys them. And I did get... From Society6, they were running like a Black Friday, Thursday deal. And I got the sweater, too. I'm just looking at the sweater suit. I don't know if you can see it, but this is an A-Fall Man. It's on the back. Let me see if I can... Eh, can you see that? Probably not. But anyways, it says it's got this on the back. And, uh, Society6 was running a deal for like Black Friday, $5 off, free shipping. So I got that shirt there. Then uh, I got this. I think this was like 37 which is kind of overpriced. I mean, it is overpriced, even $5 off. But uh, I figured some people were wanting to see the other side of the wall and see where the train goes when it goes through the tunnel and goes over there. So I figured I'll take you over there and show you what I got going on, on that side. So let's go over and check it out. So this is the other side of my Lego room. It's basically just... A workout room it's very small I mean it's like six feet by like ten feet I think that's why I was kind of thinking about just converting the whole thing over into the Lego room which I would have to see these walls are insulated out here I'd have to insulate the walls put up some wood I basically just built this wall in between here this this whole shed used to be like a chicken coop I think a long time ago it's got windows over here and that's the that's how, kind of how I get to the other side of the Lego room. Let's see if I can open this up. So there is the back side of the city. You don't see that angle very often. So you can kind of come over here and do some shots if you wanted to. I just got my weight bench. I got like a sit-up bench. And this room is full of stuff. You can see I got it cluttered. And then I got tools hanging here. So basically to run the train, all I did was cut a hole in the wall right there. And then put up a 2 by 4 and then just ran it so it runs through there. I thought about sitting out of here and propping up the camera and setting up a little scene kind of like off of uh, Mr. Rogers Neighborhood. Have the train come through and take me over to the Lego City or something. Uh, I thought that would be funny. And I know people will ask, how much do I bench press? And I probably bench press about 70 pounds. No, I'm just playing. I really don't max out because I'm here by myself and I don't want to have one of those videos go viral where I'm getting crushed by a weight bench and I can't get it off me. But I usually probably bench, I do reps around 200. But that's what I do over here, man. It's really, like I said, no room over here. I got to like stand in the doorway to leave the building to basically get a shot of the whole building. But this would really make the Lego Lego City bigger if I moved it over here. Let's go back over to the other side. So as you guys saw, I do have some room over there. But there's not a lot of room over there. Just That would just mainly give me about 6 by 10. So about, I don't know, what's that, 6 times 10? 60 cubic, 60 square feet of more Lego City. Which, I mean, that would be a nice addition to the city, but... I don't know, I've also even thought about just completely getting a new building or completely 
buying a new building, building a new building for the Lego City. But, I don't know. I also want to tell you guys, I have partnered up with Brixar. And we both have this large 8-in-1 Minecraft set. I'm going to build half of the sets in there. And Brixar is going to build the other half. We figure we both know about the equal amount on Minecraft. So, uh, look forward to that coming. I'm going to build the first two probably the next couple days. And he's going to build the uh, three and four. And then we're going to just shoot to each other's videos. I have been out here kind of reorganizing, taking all the stuff that I have a lot of that are in like two drawers, combining them into larger drawers, trying to add to the BrickLink store. But that will probably do it for this vlog, guys. Let me know if you appreciate it by giving me a thumbs up. I definitely appreciate you guys watching and giving me thumbs up and giving me comments. And I look forward to seeing you in other videos. Talk to you later. Bye.